Hi everyone, welcome to study physics. Here's the question number 37. In a set of n successive polarizer, the mth polarizer makes an angle m pi by 2n with a vertical. A vertically polarized light beam of intensity I0 is incident on two such sets with n equal to n1 and n equal to n2, where n2 greater than n1. Let the intensity of light beams coming out be I n1 and I n2 respectively. Which of the following statement is correct about the outgoing beams? So, first of all, we have to know Mellus law. So, Mellus law is I equal to I naught cos square theta I. So, if there is a polarizer, this is the axis and if this is initial intensity I naught, then the transmitted intensity is I and the theta I is, theta I is the angle between the lights initial polarization and the axis of the polarizer. Now if we deal with three polarizer like this, so this is I naught let's say this is I1 and this is I2 and this is our first, second, third polarizer and this is making an angle and after transmitted the angle will little bit the polarizer will uh, little bit tilted and like this so here they have already given that that mth polarizer makes an angle m pi by 2n so for mth polarizer, the angle is m pi by 2n. So for first polarizer, theta 1 is pi by 2n. And that means that between these two, the angle is theta equal to pi by 2n. And for these two, Again, the theta is pi by 2n. But for 1 and 3, the angle between them is 2 pi by 2n. That means pi by n. So we can write if i1 is i0 cos squared pi by 2n. Then i1 divided by i0 is cos square pi by 2n. Same we can write I2 is I1 here I1 is initial cos square pi by 2n because adjacent polarizers making an angle uh, pi by 2n sorry this is 2n so I2 by in I1 is cos square pi by 2n. So I2 divided by I1 into I1 divided by I0 is cos square pi by 2n into cos square pi by 2n. I1, I1 will be cancelled out. So here I2 divided by I0 is cos to the power 4 pi by 2n. So I2 is I0 cos to the power we can say 2, do, 2 into 2 pi by 2n. So for nth polarizer we can write In is I0 cos to the power 2n pi divided by 2n. 
so here they have told us that on two such sets with n equal to n1 and n equal to n2 where n2 greater than n1 so if n equal to n1 equal to n equal to 1 for that case i 1 equal to i naught cos square pi divided by 2 into 1 cos pi by 2 is 0 that means this is 0 and if n2 equal to 2 then i2 is i naught cos 2 into 2 cos to the power 2 into 2 divided by pi 2 into 2 that means i naught cos to the power 4 pi divided by 4 we know cos pi by 4 is 1 by root 2 that means cos to the power 4 i naught divided by 4 which is 0.25 i naught so from here we can say that for n2 greater than n1 intensity of n2 is also greater than intensity of n1 so here is two option which says that i n2 greater than i n1 a and c now the polarization so they have given us theta is m pi divided by 2 n so when the polarizer polarizer is nth like m is n so the theta is pi n divided by 2 n so n n will cancel out so pi by 2 that means if the polarizer making an angle making an angle vertically then after nth polarizer the polarizer will make an angle like this that means for um, uh, the difference between the two polarizer from first and the from uh, from first to from nth the angle will be pi by 2 that means horizontal so the first option is sorry so the third is horizontal which is correct thank you for watching this video please like share and subscribe